growing mushroom i bought bio blooms terrace gardening grow tub with top support from amazon it provides more space reduces heat easily foldable low cost uv treated and reusable Make a mixture each of 6 kg vermiform compost cow dung manure and soil in a big tub Button mushrooms require a growing environment that contains a lot of nitrogen The manure and compost mixture will produce a strong smell so make it in a well ventilated area Move the bag to a dark place like a root cellar basement garage or even a closet keep checking the temperature and moisture of the soil to make sure it isn't too warm or dry Spray the compost mixture thoroughly with water two times a day. The temperature of the room should be maintained at 21 degrees Celsius. In case the temperature falls, then you can use a room heater. Pour the mixture into the bag carefully, leaving at least one inch of space at the top of the bag. Take a few banana leaves and cut them into smaller pieces and set them aside. Banana leaves have been used here as they have high content of those fibers, which have high potential for the development of edible mushrooms. Here is the packet of wheat bran. I have heated the wheat bran for 10 to 15 minutes to make it free from germs. You should make sure that the mixture is leveled and is spread evenly across it. Now sprinkle the wheat bran on the compost mixture evenly. then plow it well
spread the banana leaves on top of the wheat bran and again plough it well. Cover the banana leaves with cow dung. <laughs> you must purchase ready-made spawn from an experienced mushroom cultivator as this will result in the production of better mushroom. Spread the ready-made spawn on top of the compost mixture. This should be followed by ploughing to make an even layer. Spray it thoroughly with water. After approximately 2 weeks, the top of the soil will be covered in tiny white roots called mycelium. When the whole of the soil is completely covered, you have to lower the temperature to approximately 10 degrees Celsius to encourage growth of the first mushrooms.
Here the soil is being loosened. Cover the mycelium with one inch of potting soil. This layer will protect the delicate mycelium and provide nutrients for the new mushrooms as they grow. Keep adding water every day to maintain the moisture content of the mixture. 